How you doing? Um, can you not do that? Why not? Because I'm really not comfortable with it. Well, it's alright. I'm comfortable with it, so. Yeah, but I'm not. Why? Well, what's your problem? Um, nothing. I just prefer to not be touched. Don't worry about it. It's okay. I'm gonna worry about it. Thank you. Okay, so in the first scene of our production, we have um, Robert go in and touch Sam without permission. Like, Sam doesn't ask for him to touch her or even anything. He initiates the whole contact by himself, and she shows uncomfort immediately, and yet he continues and persists. And everyone in the background is kind of just silent, and it's likely they can see it. It's not like you're not going to notice something happening in front of you, but they don't act because people don't really do that in real life. Up. Um, can you not? What, am I not good enough for you or something? It's not that I'm just not really interested in that. I'm here to go to school and that's it. Come on. You know. No, like, stop. Seriously, stop. Why are you making a scene for it? Because I'm just not comfortable with it. Um, personally, if it was me, I wouldn't like to be touched, especially because I feel like I'm the owner of my body. So when somebody's constantly trying to put their hands on me, it makes me kind of lose respect for myself. I feel like him not having respect towards me is like, okay, so like, what do you really think of me? Yeah, like there's, you just keep on to tell him to stop, say no, if that doesn't work, you have to tell somebody, like an adult, to tell him to stop. Yeah. Hey, I like your jacket, it's cute. Um, well, that's good, I can walk you across there. Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Come on, I can walk you across. Can you honestly just stop? What bothers me most about this clip in production is the fact that he's able to go after another girl because the first girl didn't tell anyone anything, so. There's no one to stop him, no one to punish him. And even though she does come back at the end, only she tells him to stop. That doesn't mean he actually has to. Exactly what he said. I feel like you should always speak up about the situation because that gives other people that have been through that more confidence because they see you doing it, so they'll just own up to it too and maybe he'll be stopped sooner. Yeah, and the fact that, you know, it's bad enough that it was one girl, but now that it's two, that, that makes it even more un uncomfortable. Hey, Alex. Ryan, can you please stop? Why? What do I have to stop for? You do this every day. What? I'm just talking to you. You make me feel so uncomfortable, Ryan. Can you please stop? No, I don't. You know you like it. I playing. don't. Yes, you do. I'm not playing. <laughs> You guys just saw the clip where Brian was extremely aggressive towards Alex. Uh, how he was, there was a lot of physical contact. Uh, have you guys seen it or witnessed this before? And what's your feel on that particular clip? I have seen it before, but in person, it's harder to act on because you don't understand their situation. Like, you don't know how they react towards each other. But I feel like also rejection means no. If you're told no, no means no. Simple. Hey, this is my favorite person, Alex. Hey, how you doing? Please, I'm just trying to get uh, Wait, we're not popping you. What, Brian? So, 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 what's up with us? There's nothing up with us. I've told you a million times I'm not interested. Are you crying? Why are you crying? Brian, I'm sick and tired of you tormenting you, constantly asking for a kiss and constantly sending me pictures. I'm not interested. What? How? Man, you ain't nothing. Now, you guys just saw the second clip where Alex was on her way to class and Brian caught her before she got to class and he started making unwanted advances towards her. What's your feel on it? I feel like the moment she started crying, he should have stopped. But at the same time, I feel like she should have walked away from it. Like, she, did, she didn't have to stay there. She, she had the choice. She could have just walked away. Now, what if in that, that particular moment, she was scared? She was nervous? 
She should have looked for somebody. You do know she felt, at that point, she looked cornered, right? So. Um, that second scene, like, when she started crying, like, that's what, like, really got me mad, and he, like, got mad about it. Like, he should have just stopped. He should have just stopped and just left it. Yeah, I feel like as a young man, you're taught to treat women with respect by your mother. Simple, you should just know when a girl doesn't want you to act a certain way towards her. Yo, 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 PB, bro, PB. Yo, I just got like three girls Snapchats, like four girls. You lying. You lying. Ryan, you're wanted in the main office. What, what'd I do? I think you know what you did. Let's go. Come I, on. I didn't do nothing. You know, come on. Well, she said she liked it. Well, you know, clearly. On the last clip, where Alex Quinn told the teacher, and Brian was on his phone talking. He's on his phone talking about all the girls he got, whatever it may be. And he made the comment about she wanted it. What's your feedback on it? I feel like the she wanted it comment was a little overboard, especially because he knows that she was not feeling the same vibe he was. They were clearly told like. She was telling him no the whole time, how uncomfortable she felt. He should have just left her alone. I feel like that was very ignorant of him. He shouldn't have done that, but she did the right thing on telling somebody. Like, she spoke up for herself. Yeah, same as what they said. Like, I feel like that was just ignorant. And the, as a fact, like, he was still, like, kind of, like, you know, happy about it. Like, he was showing his other friends that all these photos and all that. And that's really ignorant. Now, here's the thing. Before we wrap this up, as teenagers, do you guys, is, is it more, when you see it through social media, is it more through pictures where, where the kids make unwanted advances, or is it just physical like we saw in the video? Pictures. Okay. Pictures. It depends, honestly, because a lot of it we see, but we don't understand it as it is. We see it as, oh, he's playing around. He just, he likes her, and she doesn't really feel that way at all.